name is Evan Champlin, and I'm a uh, gameplay and level designer, and I'm also the uh, team's resident weapons expert. Basically, uh, I uh, write design documentation. Uh, I write, I wrote all the weapon, um, the weapon functionality, gameplay stuff. Uh, I also build levels, um, and I, and being the team's resident expert, I answer any questions anyone has about the weapons, how they move, how they function, what they're supposed to look like, which ones, all the little details. People come to me asking uh, all sorts of things about the weapons. Um, you know, I've got the sound guy asking me how this is supposed to, you know, what what the bolt's supposed to sound like when it closes, you know, versus you know, around being chambered or being empty, or you know, I've got the artist coming to me and asking me, you know, which particular rail system is on this weapon system, or you know, which weapon system we should be doing. Um, in the army, there's a lot of variation out there, and uh, I know enough about them to point out the differences between them. So. The, the ballistic simulations in the game are very accurate. Um, the, the data that we've acquired is real-world data, and not to mention um, you know, the, the, the experience from the designers, uh, actually firing the weapon systems, and the SMEs telling us how it should be, and stuff like that. This is one of our rubber ducks. Uh, it's replicating a uh, M4 MWS. Uh, basically, the, uh, it's just a, a rubber mold of the actual weapon system. Uh, the reason why we have these at the office is um, it's uh, it's great for artists to actually have the be able to put the prop in their hand and see it move around, be able to see it three dimensionally, look at the rail system, how our thing works. Um, this one is non-functional; it doesn't have any moving parts or anything like that. We have a few models that do, and that's that's great for animation purposes, uh, motion capture, sound capture. Um, they're just uh, really convenient to have around the office. They're great for designers too, um, so we can uh, talk about how the weapons are supposed to handle the game. Um, uh, great for when we have SMEs here and they're showing us how to move with the weapons. Uh, so um, they're, it's, it's, it's really convenient to have them on hand and that's why we have a big room that's full of them.